Hi, and welcome back to The Kicking System. I'm John Maddich. Uh, today we're going to talk about kicking tees. So normally, uh, when you're starting kicking, it's Pop Warner, youth level, and also freshman, maybe even sophomore year, what we recommend is using a two-inch kicking block. Okay? This guy right here in my hand, uh, sometimes it uh, looks like a big black tank, but uh, highly recommended when you start kicking because it gives you the elevation to help get you height on the ball especially when you're kind of learning the basic fundamentals. Um, like I said, normally two inches, that's about the highest you're allowed to go these days. Um, but as you get more comfortable in your kicking technique, and as you get older and stronger, what we recommend is going with a one inch uh, field goal block. Uh, the one inch allows you still to get some height on it, um, but it gives you a little bit more power as you get the lower elevation. And what sometimes guys do is they actually might even chisel down the one inch tee to maybe a half inch or just basically a piece of plastic so they put on the ground for the holder, especially in their senior year. Um, you know, I always suggest that if you can have some sort of, uh, whatever, being a half inch or one inch tee, uh, a lot of guys come to me and ask me about, oh, can I use a, you know, can I just kick off the ground? And, you know, that's, it's a tough thing to do because usually snapping the holders usually not that good at being able to put the ball down the right way so if you can use a one inch tee um, or, or some sort of placement holder thing that would probably be your best bet. Another question or comment I get a lot uh, is asking about when to kick off the ground especially in the youth level. Um, the best thing I recommend to you is, is starting to really kick off the ground maybe a little bit playing around as a sophomore uh, but primarily everything after junior year in your off season should be off the ground because if you're planning to go to college camps, uh, kind of want to go to college at the next level, I highly recommend kicking off the ground. Uh, coaches like to see that, especially if you come into a summer camp and other guys are using tees and you're kicking just as far as well um, off the ground. So uh, if you want to go ahead and play around, you know, uh, as a sophomore, I, don't, I, I really don't mind, but you know, start to get really into the off-the-ground stuff after junior year. Um, that is our, our best recommendation. Um, another question I get is, when are you ready to make the transition from a two-inch to a one-inch tee? Uh, normally, if you're getting a lot of height on the ball, um, you're getting a lot of undercut, uh, getting a lot of spin on the ball, uh, but also still having a, some pretty good power, probably about that time, again, you're maybe in that 14, 15, 16 years old, making sophomore junior year is probably a good time to go down to a one inch tee. Um, like I said, if you're getting a lot, a lot of height, maybe sometimes miss hitting it because you're getting underneath it too much, probably that good time to make that transition down to a one inch tee um, going from there. Normally, where you can buy these, if your high school doesn't have them, um, you can find them at wizardkicking.com. Uh, talking to those guys over there usually will set you up the right one again if you can ask for a two inch field goal block or a one inch field goal block it's probably your best bet occasionally you could find them at a sporting goods store uh, but no, like a sports chalet sports authority of that nature but your best bet is ordering them online from wizard kicking another question or comment i get a lot is are you allowed to use a t at the college professional ranks and obviously the, uh, the answer to that question is no so what I recommend, donate it, um, send it to another uh, kicker, maybe at your school, and, and kind of uh, get used to kicking off the ground right away. Uh, another great invention they have here with the tees, and also something I could recommend to you guys, is the Ground Zero tee. Now this tee um, acts as a field goal block. Basically, this middle section comes out. If you flip it onto the side here, and you throw it all the way down, you have a two inch field goal block. Pretty cool I thought. Um, if you push it out, real simple, and you flip it around the other way, it can also become a two inch kickoff tee. And what I recommend with that, a lot of guys will put a piece of plastic or a piece of wood here to help keep it up. Uh, could be about an inch as far as width. You can place it in there and then tee on top so it keeps it level. Or if you push it place it all the way down, it becomes a one inch kickoff block. So um, again, called the ground zero 
can purchase that wizard kicking. It's a great invention. Could basically be the need of all of your kicking tees.